Hi, and welcome to the second part of a five-part tutorial series on flash track send reports. In this video, we'll walk through the necessary steps that you'll need to take in order to successfully upload your project workbooks from within flash track, which, if you may not know, is Facility Results' flagship Arc Flash data collection tool. Now, before you can upload or do anything, you'll need to make sure you're connected to the internet. You'll also need to have your Send Reports account credentials on hand. You'll need to use those credentials within FlashTrack so that the projects you wish to upload get associated to you and your account. It is worth mentioning that you should check to see if you have any missing attributes or incomplete items on your one-line diagram. Electrical items with missing attributes are shown as orange within your one-line. Remembering that once all the necessary data has been filled in for an electrical item, the item turns black. Lastly, when everything has been filled in and your project passes validation, you'll be able to upload your project to flash track send reports. Once you're connected online and have opened up the project workbook that you wish to upload within flash track, you'll want to click the file button at the top left of the main flash track window and then navigate to the project backstage tab. Here, you'll click the sign in button and enter your send reports account credentials. When you're signed in, the button should now read sign out and your account name should promptly be displayed on the screen. As shown here, Clicking the Sign Out button allows you to either sign out or log in using a different Send Reports account. Now that you're signed in, you'll need to make sure that all the attribute data that's required for each electrical item has in fact been filled in. The easiest way to do this is by using the Hide Completed toggle within the Find dialog window. Additionally, you can launch the validation checker by either clicking the Send to Flash Track or Upload buttons within the Backstage. Here, you'll see the electrical items that failed to validate along with a list of missing attributes. When all required attribute fields have been filled in, you can upload your project workbook by either clicking the Upload or Send to Flash Track buttons within the Backstage view. During the upload process, you should see a dialog window that's similar to the one shown here. Depending on the size of your project and speed of your internet connection, the upload process may take a couple of minutes. You'll be prompted when everything is done or if there were any errors during the upload process. Thank you for taking the time to watch the second part of our Flash Track Send Reports tutorial series. You can always reach us via the method shown here. Thanks again, and I'll see you in the next one.